Hey folks, Ben of the Sawtooth Avalanche Center here. We're standing up here on Titus Ridge at Sunday afternoon at the tail end of this first big storm that's hitting our early season snowpack. And the results are not pretty. Uh, I'm standing above uh, the crown of this uh, large avalanche that I remotely triggered from about 500 feet away on the ridge. Uh, and this crown is at least 700 feet wide, I'd say. A bit hard to say with uh, how poor the visibility is out here. This failed on these early season facets that we've got in our snowpack. And sitting below those facets in many places is a stiff crust, which is a pretty bad combination. When those avalanches start, it's pretty easy for them to pick up speed and they run fast and far and can take you for quite the ride uh, if you're not expecting it or even if you are. So that's kind of the state of the snowpack right now. Uh, still early in the season, down low, you're way, way, way less likely to find avalanches worth where you have this new snow falling on the ground. But as soon as you get up to where we have older snow underneath, uh, Things are pretty darn touchy and spooky. Uh, this type of weak layer is gonna stick around for a bit. You can trigger these slides from a distance away and they might break a bunch wider than you might expect like this one did here. 